Welcome back, viewers. Uh, let's see. We heard a, about a problem in a medical clinic, and there just so happens to be a door right here. Before we go in, though, another keeper. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, Doc. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or Who are you? Let her go. Headshots. Over there. Let's go on and uh oh no, nope, that's a pistol. Stop running. Did you just fucking glitch? Oh, I'm out of grenades. All right, that's everyone. That's it. Bag him and tag him. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. It was a big risk. Thinking. You could have hit the hostage. There wasn't time to think. I just reacted. I didn't mean to. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you, all of you. I know those men threatened you, but if you tell us who they work for, we can protect you. They worked for Feast. They wanted to shut me up. Keep me from telling Garrus about this warrior. The one I told you about, Shepard. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council, and a disgrace to my people. Welcome aboard, Garrus. Fist is going to be waiting for us. When we hit him, we better hit him hard. I'd be able to hit him harder if I had any grenades, but unfortunately, I used all of them up on accident because I keep hitting G. Uh, before I go anywhere. Nope, uh, squad. Senor Garen needs some levels. Awesome. Also, before I go anywhere, Doctor. I properly thank you for saving me from Fist's thugs, Commander. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't been there. Happy to help. I'm just glad you weren't hurt. Me too. Now, was there anything you needed? You're a doctor. How did you end up here on the Citadel? My parents brought me here when I was young. My father was a medic with the Alliance. I chose to keep the medical tradition alive, but not the military. Fixing up wounded soldiers isn't my idea of fun. Uh, tell that to Dr. Chakwas. Let me take a look at what you have for sale. Of course. So I will be back to this lady many a times, as uh, later on she will start carrying uh, Metagel upgrades. Uh, she also has the... Uh, uh, carries the higher tier first aid interfaces, which, again, I'm going to make sure I have the best version I can on me pretty much at all times, just because it is real nice having that health regen playing a class that doesn't have native health regen. Okay. So we got ourselves a Garrison to Rex. Wanna pop that? Let's see. I think there might be a keeper within here, but I'm not completely sure. No, no, there isn't. Emily Wong. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. I'm Emily Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? Of course. What do you need? I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. How do you know that my investigation is going to uncover anything you need? You wouldn't be investigating if it weren't big. And if it's big, it's something I'd like to hear about. You've got to have access to better sources. Why contact me? I'm using every source I can find, but I think I've got a better shot with you. 
According to your file, you survived back on the cruise when everyone else in your squad got killed. If anyone can find the worst elements of the Citadel and live to tell about it, it's you. How do you know I'm investigating anything here on the Citadel? I'm a good journalist, Commander Shepard. Word gets around. Consider it done. Cause. If I find any information, it's yours. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. I'm not a bastard to every journalist. Just the ones that piss me off. Uh, yeah, let's go into the markets first. What colonies are you talking about? Oh, my mistake, Earth Clan. I assumed it doesn't matter. Pharos? Novaria? Well, if you haven't heard of them yet, I'm sure you will soon. But it doesn't matter where you hail from. My goods are available to all. What can you tell me about Novaria? The corporate capital of the Attican Traverse. Very cold. Very snowy. I don't get too many clients from there. They all have their own private suppliers. I'd like to know more about Pharos. It's an old Prothean world. Their buildings still litter the surface. The humans aren't the first to colonize it, but they are the most recent. Hmm. I just realized I haven't heard from my contact on that planet for some time. Ah, uh, well, I'm sure he's fine. Show me what you've got. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. Let's see. So I can get a Metagel upgrade if I had the fucking money to buy it. Uh, he does sell one of the first bio amps that I could get. More importantly, though, he has a license. And that's all I can afford. Oh god, this guy. Wow, it's you. You're Commander Shepard, the hero of Eden Prime. I am so honored to meet you. Nice to meet you. And you are? My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. I spend most of the time trying to stay alive and help the colonists. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? I mean, it's more around 15 or so, Geth, if you exclude the husks. Anything for a fan. Here. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back to work. I feel sorry Next for her. Here on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. But I gotta be nice. Because, again, if this were the first time playing it and I'd be answering how I would in real life, then I gotta be nice. Moreland! Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Standard items. Morlan has his own license, which we will go ahead and buy, as well as a Metagel upgrade and grenade upgrade. I'll be back for those later. Corbin! Or, sorry, Shorbin. Commander, I wasn't expecting to see you again. Is there something you want? You can start by telling me the truth, Shorbin. I'm not sure what you're referring to. My experiments are... We're not buying it. Jaleed told us you've been after it. You spoke with Jaleed? Then you know about the data? No, but you're gonna tell me. Everything. You boys can go. Looks like my plans have changed. It's not as bad as you think, Commander. Jaleed and I just got a little over our heads. Keep talking. The 
company we work for developed an experimental procedure for use in medical scanners. Jalid and I saw even more potential, so we stole the plans and secretly developed a tool to scan the keepers. Can you imagine a tool that can actually get readings from the keepers? What's so special about that? The keepers are almost impossible to scan, and you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. You've seen it yourself, Commander. You know we can do it. Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Jalid's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. I don't know. So you're just trying to get back what Jalid already stole? We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. Commander, if you'll just continue gathering data for me, imagine what we might learn. You stand to make a bit of a profit yourself, remember? I suppose a little scanning here and there won't hurt anyone? Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jalid. The data you're gathering for me is useless if Jalid won't help me analyze it. I'll go have a chat with him right now. Thank you. And happy scanning, Commander. And by right now, I mean in a little bit. Because I do find myself near Cora's Den. Yeah, first things first, we're going to come over here. Because there is a keeper. Leads. Yep, back here. Okay. Now we're going to Gorest Inn. Weapons drawn. Eh, not really. Bad. God, I wish I had more grenades. God, I wish I didn't waste all my grenades. As those grenades would have made this section coming. You know what? Actually, before I do that, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. equipment. Uh, yeah, just have hammerhead. Yeah, I've got phaser crowns. I want hammerhead on it though. Recoil dampener is going to be better for that. And yeah, we'll pop an improved sight for you. Just in the off chance I need to use the pistol, we'll go on and uh, equip it with that. Alright, that should do good. Good job. These guys are a pain. They have insane region. Uh, yeah, uh, they have insane region in addition to An ability to just choose to not die. I will destroy you. Yeah, good luck with that. Uh. 
Uh, nope, that's the shotgun. Good night, sweet prince. Nighty night. I do love me sniper rifle. So it would appear. Let's look around for lootables first. Yeah, I don't see any lootables. Funny how there's a uh, mission marker on the map, even though the guy we need to talk to isn't here. Stop right there! Don't come any closer. Is it really worth your wife, dude? All the real guards must be dead. Stay back, or we'll shoot. Save yourselves. You're not going to win this. Be a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. Yeah, I never like fist anyway. <laughs> Quicker to just kill them. Shooting people isn't always the answer. Yeah, if we want to get paragon points, we need to not shoot them. Take all. And that is better than what I've got, albeit with a little less accuracy, so I'll go on and swap to that. Shotgun, again better. No new pistol. Uh, hmm. Yeah. And I still like the... Uh, yeah. Oops. Didn't mean to fully exit. Okay. better. Go, go, go. Wait, don't kill me, I surrender. Where's the quarry? She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait, I don't know where the quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The quarian isn't here, said she'd only deal with the shadow broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker. Ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Give me the location. Now. Here on the wards. The back alley of the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. What are you doing? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. Never do that again. I'm in charge here. You ever pull another stunt like that? It was the only contract I had left. And don't we have something more pressing to worry about? That quarian's dead if we don't go now. Oh, well, before we go. Go on and pop that, and take what's in this. Oops. There we go. Take all. They say if you don't go now, but, I mean, you got plenty of time, even if you stop to loot, like I do.
got him. Slap you. <laughs> well, good place to uh, take a break and uh, <laughs> level up. Uh, now we'll keep on uh, leveling up our decryption and electronics. Garrus, again, still don't rightly care, so we'll auto level you. And same with. Or not, Rex. That's it. Bag him and tag. That's why I like my grenades. If you're a good aim with them, you can just lob it in just the right spot to tag an enemy that doesn't want to come out of hiding. Shadow broker, where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. Hands off, Touchy. Hands off. Yeah, nice nade launch. Do it. Fist set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. Nice. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards and all out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many? Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss. My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. 
He said even Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. The Reapers are a threat to every species in Citadel space. We have to tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audiophiles prove Saren's a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian. My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Point taken. Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Ah, uh, probably Captain will. And I will go ahead to get things ready with the council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. So we'll bring you, and might as well bring Rex. And once again, <laughs> out of level because I don't care. My allies are more cannon fodder than allies to me. <laughs> no, that sounds terrible, but unfortunately it is true. For now, though, we'll go on and call it here as it's been about 30, and we'll see y'all next time. See you soon, viewers. Cheers.